this insect could tear your skin off. Deep in the Carboniferous Swamp, 30 million years before the first dinosaurs, the air was thick, heavy, and hot. Towering ferns cast long, dark shadows on the damp ground, but it wasn't the heat or the darkness you had to worry about. It was the sound, a faint rhythmic buzzing that grew louder and louder. Imagine a dragonfly, but not the kind you see today. This was Meganura. Its wingspan stretched nearly three feet wide, its body a thick, armored fuselage. Its eyes, massive compound lenses, saw everything in a 360-degree panorama. It was the apex predator of the air. As it flew, its serrated legs, covered in sharp spines, formed a deadly basket. It didn't just catch its prey, it impaled it, shredding it mid-flight. It could snatch small amphibians and other giant insects right out of the air, its powerful mandibles crushing their exoskeletons in an instant. But here's the truly terrifying part. Scientists believe its larvae were just as deadly. They were aquatic hunters, armed with a horrifying, extendable jaw that shot out like a harpoon to grab anything that swam too close. They were born killers, lurking in the dark waters below. Imagine you're standing at the edge of that ancient swamp. A shadow passes over you. The buzzing is deafening. You look up and see it a monster of the sky, its wings slicing through the humid air. It banks, its huge eyes locked on you. It doesn't hunt you, it simply plummets from the sky like a living guillotine. And the only thing it left behind was silence. 